Are you from Australia? Where are you from? No. Okay, that means move along, bitch. Okay, I understand. I see how it works with you. I thought we had something and it's over. All right, yes, okay, I got it. All right, our next comic, come on! A Jersey native, she works Atlantic City. She's a suburban mom slash full-time comic. Linda Belt, here I am! A woman of a certain age, and I know things. I know things the young girls don't know. You young girls do dumb things like fake it. Faking it is stupid. It's a waste of time. It's a waste of energy. It's so much easier to just say, God, you suck, go home. I know I don't have cellular. Get the hell out of here. I just tell everybody I got caught in a storm. This is hail damage, baby. Hail damage. You young girls, your body's your temple. Enjoy it. Mine's like a haunted house at a carnival. Strange sounds, strange smells. I don't know what the hell's coming around that corner. Better watch it, young girls. The young cats are going after the older babes like me because they're smart. Because they know us old debates know how to do all the freaky stuff. <laughs> Filthy things. Filthy things that you girls never heard of. Like separating his whites from his darks when I do his laundry. Like I babe it up. I babe it up. I took a pole dancing class. Oh, that was sexy. The highlight of my class was taking my stripper shoes to my podiatrist. Insulted. No more. Screw that. Ma'am is short for madam. If I look like the type of gal who can run a call girl ring, I'll take it as a compliment. I run on those fancy $5,000 an hour call girl rings. What the hell can you do for $5,000 an hour? If my man were caught with a $5,000 an hour hooker, I'd be pissed about the $5,000. I mean, $5,000, you idiot. You idiot, you couldn't talk to me. Maybe, maybe, I had a coupon! <laughs> relationships change when you're a man. Relationships, supposedly in a long-term relationship, the hormonal level switch. The man's testosterone goes down, the woman's goes up. That explains it. Where the hell the bocce balls go and my mustache came from? <laughs> oh, just what I need, more testosterone is my libido isn't out of control. I'm out of control! <laughs> I went on a fishing trip. When the captain said, hey lady, my rod is ready, I got undressed. <laughs> I read Cosmo. Hey, Cosmo said the guys are looking for our G-spots, ladies. Don't bother. Look for Loch Ness Monster or Bigfoot. You'll find it sooner. <laughs> Scouts to talk during lovemaking, ladies, but not too loud. That's getting a little harder at my age. What'd you say? <laughs> you know it is just time to hang that up when you have to say, hey, baby, don't talk dirty. Into my good ear. <laughs> I have a 22-year-old daughter. She tries to bait me up. She takes me shopping. She says, Mommy, get a pair of those pants with the words across the back. You will look so hot. I turned around, looked in the mirror. My pants just said, too tight. <laughs> she wanted to take me to have my belly button pierced. Yeah, as if that thing is going to see the light of day. <laughs> oh, screw it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. I figure 20 years from now it will come in very handy. I'll use it as an extra hook for my bra. <laughs> Homework. Remember that famous one, Mommy, when will I ever use geometry? When will I ever use it? So finally I looked at her and I said, Honey, when you're a grown-up lady and married, you never know. Your husband might say to you, Hey, baby, 
let's try it tonight from another angle. <laughs> and I said, sweetheart, I suggest you know 90 from 45. <laughs> I only wanted two kids. I went for a tubal ligation. I get to the hospital. It says reason for surgery. My nurse said, you have to write something. So it's a tubal ligation, reason for surgery. So I wrote, I do not want to drive a van. <laughs> Everybody's an expert with the parenting. I saw an expert on television when my kids were little. And he said, if your child asks a sex question, honest, he said, if your child asks this X question, this is what the expert said to do. He said, be open, be honest, most importantly, smile. Why smile? So your kids would not be uptight about sex. I said, well, okay, I can do this. So my daughter comes home. Mommy, could the man get stuck? <laughs> oh, honey, only if you're very, very lucky. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I am Linda Belt and you are fabulous.